Mike Tendo 64 presents. Hello, everybody, and welcome to the Mike Tendo 64 Super Mario Maker Pro Show with Mike Scorpio. Okie dokie, let's go! Hee <laughs> hello, everybody, and welcome to the show with me, Mike Scorpio. I know guys, you're probably getting tired of that by now, but what can I say? I'm juvenile! Anyway, so, um, welcome back to uh, the Super Mario Maker Bros show. Uh, this is episode 2 of season 2, and we are playing through uh, a number of different course IDs from dedicated um, Mario Makers. So in each episode we will dedicate ourselves to uh, each individual uh, Mario Maker, play through a couple of their levels, uh, so that you guys can get a general feel of not just the various levels that are out there, but what other levels each maker has to offer. So, in today's episode we are featuring Wombat, and he takes um, this guy, Mario, and he puts him in the shoes of this guy, Link, to create the Legend of Mario Ocarina of Time. So what he has done, he has um, ingeniously recreated uh, the uh, Ocarina of Time uh, from the beginning up to about um, the Lost Woods heading towards the Forest Temple to date. But we can't show you all of them, we're just going to show you how far we've got to at the moment, which is to Dodongo's Cavern, which is just to come. So, we're going to take you from the title sequence up to Dodongo's Cavern in this episode. So, without further ado, let's get to it. Now this uh, one right here is the title sequence. So, as like the original title sequence of the game, uh, Link is on top of a pona, or is on uh, a pona room. On top of a I shouldn't say about that, should I really? Um, so, yes. I'll just cut the doors and take you through our Carina. Time. This is just a nice little simple level uh, to get you into uh, one bat series. So I'm just going to climb up over here. Now we're on top of Death Mountain there. All down, and there is the flag. And much like the original game, you start off in Kokiri Forest. So, here we are, Mario, the train, young Link, so to speak. I'll get over the bridge, the other of the uh, houses, get through the tunnel here. And this is like the, uh, well, there's the, the little tunnel area where you go to collect the Kakiri sword, and you've got the giant boulders that are trying to crush you. And you have to reach the chest, which is this here. This is a nice little design for the chest there. You'll see a lot more of those as we progress through the levels. Just squeeze past there and go through here. Now that we are big Mario, strong Mario, we can break through here now. So just go through here and avoid the boomers. Okay. Over. Up there. Ooh. And we're in the waterfall area here. We're going to fall down here. Make it across here without dying. So let's go through here. Try to avoid the wall. Go through here. Now we are at the Great Deku Tree. Okay, so this is uh, inside the Deku Tree now. Okay, so we're going to make our way through the Great Deku Tree to defeat the evil parasite that has taken a hold of it. So we'll just come up here, put you, put you out the way. Push that down, push that down. There we go, lots of uh, vines to climb up there. And we're going through this door here. Now, the idea of this part is to avoid the prior plants, jump across the platforms to reach the chest. And the chest gives us a nice big mushroom there. 
so that we can break open the blocks in the main room. So now we lose it down. Yeah, there we go. Bang, butt stop. Straight to the pipe. There's lots of game butts in there. What I like to do is I know I like to take these switches with me until I can see where it is it's got to go. Now here, here it is. Open that up and go through the door. Take you out, sorry Nancy. Get you out a little Monty Miles there. The Monty Miles taking up the uh, role of the Deku Scrubs. Now we're going to just get that. Stand that and look underneath. Much like in the Ocarina of Time, we've got to go underneath the, uh, the rolling uh, spike bar to the pool of water. Oops! Did that need you coming with me? Sorry about that. <laughs> Let's go here. Yes, there we go. Oh, we did need that. I don't think it would be anywhere. And now we have the part of 23 is number one. Don't have to kill them in uh, that particular order, but it's reminiscent of the original game. And now we are supposedly can't get out anymore. So what we do is we have to take on the mini boss of the game. So you don't actually have to, you can just squeeze through here. Hit that, and we are out. And then, much like at the ending of beating the bosses, the shining light takes you up and out of the front Deku tree. So this is Hyrule Castle now. Our adventure continues, and now it's time for us to go to Hyrule Castle with the Kiri Emerald, as it is, or as it were. Across the bridge into Hyrule Town, let's have a look in some of these buildings. This would be the, uh, the ever famous pot room. Pottery room. Uh, also, there's no parts to break, just lots of coins to take. Let's go through here, try and avoid them up Oops! I won't get up there. Hang on. Now you see, we can't get through there, or can we? So, what I do, I'll go like that. Ha ha ha! Just squeeze up and over these guys. I think we'll get too close together. Doesn't matter. Open the loop. Go there. And we go through this part. Now we're in the castle uh, grounds. Inside the castle itself. Let's go through here. Go to the pipe out. Can I get you up underneath that? Yes, I can. And then just squeeze under. Nice little extra light there as well. And then. Down for a second, let them go past. No run! <laughs> now we go through this part here. And here we are at the end of the level! Our journey continues to Death Mountain now. So we have to go and meet with the great Goron and Barunia to ask him for the Goron Ruby. Make our way all the way up here. Squeeze under. And down the pipe. Now we are inside. Or uh, Death Mountain. What I do is a little trick here, yeah. so spin jump on here and takes me up. Now I've got to wait for the platform to come. Oh, 
thing in is that little chest again. So we collect that. Time jumps there. Now there is a secret, you can't just go straight through there, it will hurt you. Um, for those that are trying to speed bump the level, I'm just going to take you through this level a bit more. This is to get a general grasp, grasp even, of what the level entails. Slide underneath that. Hit that, open the door. I'll use that. Sorry, the room yet. Needs most body. Let's try to move up. Take him out, and then you continue on up and down the pipe. So now our main objective is to break into the Dongo's cabin. So what we do is wait for a bomb to arrive. I'll blow that up. I'll blow that boulder up. Now we can go into the Dongo's cabin. So inside the Dongo's cabin now, uh, it's starting to take a bit of a darker turn, and we get to use a lot of the bombs. Take them out first, so what I do, wait for nice little bar bombs in there. Blow that up there. We can go through the door. Wait for the bar bombs. Now we'll go through that door. What we'll do? It is. So I'm going to the park, pop this hook up, and use the uh, scroll platforms to move the cannons out of the way now. That's an uh, ingenious tactic there. I'm going these. There we are. If you carry on forward, there's not much. So, let's go here. Takes us to the next part. Now, so we're going to the right, we go left. Get me to the helmet then. Never mind. Okay. We'll continue on. Fortunately, you've got to hurt yourself. And now this is the bomb platform where normally you just the uh, the bomb flower to blow up the area so you can get through in the original game of course but this being Super Mario it's a all new different aesthetic and quite enjoyable as well so I'm just going to now this is the uh, narrow corridor with the uh, sliding platforms so I'm just going to here Shit. Whoops, did not leave it, do that. Sorry for swearing guys. Okay, do that. Let's go through this area here. And that's question block. Nice little mushroom for us to make it big again. Run through here. Mushroom up here as well, why not mushroom? For those that come across this in the 100 Mario Challenge, this is, there's a 
with a one up mushroom for you to collect. Now this isn't much, this is just a well actually to get the coin really. Whereas um in the operating of time that would be when you get the bomb bag. Okay, so now what are you gonna do? I'll just take it to the end of here. There's another one up mushroom for those that are collecting it. Should do that. Blow all of them up. Now, word of advice, do not go back through the door because that's where the pop on is again. So now what you do is you go down. And it's time to go inside the belly of the beast. Oops, that went on. So keep going. Just open the door. And another one up there. Just squash through there. Whoops. That one's clever. Now, this is the uh, boss battle. What are you going to do? Whoops. Get there. Wait for the blow up. Oh, we will be now. Okay. Oh, big nut now. Okay, that's quite a lot now. Whoa! I don't want to buy you. It's not my time. Wait, we get the white. There we are, we're through! Okay, I'm trying to get a little higher, though. No? And it's time for us to collect the Goron Ruby. We have just completed Don Dongo's Cabin. Oh. Well, guys, that is all we've got time for for today's show. But if you'd like to see uh, more playthroughs of Wombat's Levels, then uh, give us a shout out in the comment section below this video. Uh, and we shall do our best to recreate or to do the playthrough of the next levels in the series okay so thank you very very much for watching and wombat thank you for sending in your course ids to us via youtube uh we very very much appreciate it and it was a fantastic thrill to be able to play your levels so guys until next time ciao thanks guys and girls for watching this video if you would like to see more videos be sure to check out our youtube channel mike tendo 64 we have various web series like playthroughs and nintendo news that you may be interested in from super smash bros to super mario maker also be sure to stay up to date on various news and announcements about nintendo via our website mike 64.com you can also like and follow us on facebook and twitter well until next time keep on gaming